everyone welcome back to let's play pokemon emerald so it took me a few minutes to figure out what i was doing it's been a couple days since i recorded last but i believe last time we got ourselves the third gym badge just by the skin of our teeth pretty much and this time we're going to be making our way towards the next area now i do have meryl here who has rock smash and that's pretty much it so far. I did end up getting the HM for strength here. There it is. And I want to teach that to someone. Now you can see Ian can learn it, Gorn can learn it, and Jean can learn it. But I think Gorn can probably put it towards the best use. What move should be forgotten? I was thinking, probably Arm Thrust or Vital Throw, but we're actually going to get rid of Focus Energy. I mean, it's nice having those moves with the same type of attack bonus for now. Alright, we learned Strength, awesome. Now, let's put Tina up front, because I was wrong, she evolves at level 23. I already took care of all the trainers up here and on the route to the side. Did I battle these guys? No, I didn't. I'll do that later. But we're just going to head up this way. I haven't gone up here yet. <clears throat> so, this is the first time I'm heading up this way. I don't think I've ever talked to this guy. If you don't raise your Pokemon some more, it'd be tough to keep winning. Are stronger than gym leaders. I'm not going to battle these two. You can walk in front of them. You have to talk to them and interact with them in order to battle. But we're just going to make our way up. Now, like I said, it has been a few days since I recorded. And I've got, like, videos recorded for the next week. But, yeah. Yeah. Just been busy doing a bunch of stuff around here. <clears throat> in fact, right now it is 8.40 in the morning. I already planted some more Lepa Berries, picked some more Lepa Berries. You know, just because convenience sake. I've been doing that every... I've logged on, I believe, every 15 hours or so at this point. It's just nice to really monopolize them. I mean, they're free ethers. So why wouldn't I get them? But other than that, just kind of been, well, I already said that. But I know Times are tough with everything that's been going on. I mean, hell, I've been, you know, kind of alone for quite a long time now. And it's just, it's hard on the head, that's for sure. Especially when you've had kind of a tougher past. And people like telling you that, you know, you're not alone, that people are here for you and all this other jazz. But it's just like... If you don't message people first, it feels like no one really cares to message you at all. I mean, I've gone weeks without messaging people, and maybe one person calls in those few weeks. And every time I open my mouth to, you know, actually speak my mind, people just tend to disappear. And that makes things a lot harder. I do have a full heal. Uh, do I have? Yeah, Cherry Berry. I really want him to evolve, or her to evolve this episode. There's a guy right here. I think he has a Sandshrew. 
I know that's kind of what's been really weighing on my mind lately, just people. I don't get it. And when you do, you know, open your mouth to really speak your mind, it's like no one cares to listen. No one wants to hear it or all something else. Or people are like, well, I don't know what to tell you about that. It's, it comes down to the point where, well, you don't have to tell me anything. Just you know, be an actual friend and sit there to support. So that's why I've been doing videos and whatnot. You know, it gets me out of my head. But on a better note, finally evolving about time I've actually never used a Berloom just like I've never used Sceptile I mean I've always liked the way Berloom looks Mach Punch Ooh. Alright, we're grass fighting. Let's see after the same type of attack bonuses it'll be 60. Let's put it over stun spar. We learned mock punch. Cool. Now that that's done, let's switch it up again. I want Rose up front. So let's head over this way to fight some more trainers. But I mean, when people are going through a hard time, what what is it you guys do? I mean, are you going to sit there and listen to them and be an actual friend, or are you one of the types that are like, oh, they'll get through it on their own? I mean, do people actually understand that silence kills people? I don't know if they understand that. Or, or even better yet, there's people out there who like won't support your decisions. Like, I don't have any support backing me up doing this YouTube bit or even streaming on Twitch. No one's supporting that. I'm just doing it myself. I mean, times might be tough, but Jesus. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm kind of in a ranting mood. A lot of stuff has been going on. And it's hard not to go back to doing things that I used to do a lot. I, mean, I would drink really heavily. I would do things to myself that, you know, people shouldn't actually do. <sighs> I'm just in one of those moods, but I figured eh, I haven't recorded in a little while and, you know, it wouldn't hurt if I did. Picnicers done. Let's give our little lady some health. Uh, yeah, I did pick up a bunch of soda pops. There's a trainer right here we can battle. I actually just got done playing through this as well. Just for the hell of it, like I got two files on my system here, or on my phone here. Like I've got this one that I'm obviously doing for a playthrough of it for everyone else. And then I have my own little run that I'm doing on my on the side. And you know I like playing this game; it's fun. And the reason I'm doing that is so I can practice, like, uh, the end game stuff. And 
so many Geo dudes. All right, there we go. This guy's done. Uh, having a hard time deciding like what game I want to do after this. Like, there's so many games you can play for the Game Boy and whatnot. Oh, Jesus. Uh, here's this little fun part. The Fiery Path. A lot of Fire-type and Poison-type Pokemon you can get in here, like Coughing. You can get Torkoal, Slugma, and I believe Numel. Not really in the mood to fight. Wrong button. Fight wild Pokemon here, so I'll spray a quick repel. Just so I can run through. And make it out on the other side. Now there's more berries to pick here. We've got Ross berries. And Petra. Sweet. I didn't mean to talk to you. I did not mean to talk to you. That's alright. Starts off with a normal. That's easy. But other, you know, I'll record only a few episodes today. I don't think I'll edit them right away or anything like that. Oh, I'm surprised that didn't one hit. And there's Yon. I hate that move. But we'll take him out before we'll even be put to sleep, so. There we go. I wanted to do that as a double battle, but I guess not. And yeah, we'll go up and talk to this lady. She's another trainer. But, uh, let me know if you guys are liking actually watching these battles and whatnot. I mean, if you are, great, I'll keep doing it like this. You know, just showing off what the trainers have. Whoops, forgot to turn off my Wi-Fi. Oh well. I'll just have to blur that out. Oh hey, we got effects board. She's gonna send in a Roselia. Let's use Gorn. We'll show off our new move. There it is. Of course she's faster. Well, Gorn is a really slow Pokemon, though. Whew, that did quite a bit. Special attack rose, too bad you're not going to get to use it. And Roselia is down. Alright, we got some healing to do. Uh, Petcha. But we're coming up on an area where our grass-type Pokemon aren't going to be very useful to us. But this guy here is standing in front of this tree. What am I doing? I'm making my own room using a Pokemon move. Oh, whoops. He gives us TM43 secret power. Oh, 
It's a normal type move, but it takes on the attributes of its surrounding. So like in an area like this, it could be swift. In a grassy area, it could be stun spore. Repel we're off. But there's more berries right here. Some raspberries and orange berries. Then we're gonna show off the house down there that we just saw. And the only reason I really get a lot of the berries is so I can make uh, poke blocks later on. Because I will show off the uh, Pokemon contests. But yeah, she's like a free Pokemon Center here. Well, Pokemon Centers are all free. But you can sleep indefinitely here if you're not paying attention to what you're doing. All you need to do is rest up one time. But uh, these here, these mudslides. You need the mock bike to get up those. Can I actually walk behind her? Yes, you can. Wow. Alright, this area, Route 118, popping a repel. You see the grass changes colors. I've always liked that. But there's a bunch of trainers over there you can fight, and a lot of hidden items underneath these, like, mounds. Kind of why I like this area. And then you have your spinners like that. Some double battles as well. Ooh, Max Ether. Nice. But what I really want to show is this house here. Oh, good time for Repel to wear off. This guy. Area is covered in volcanic ash. I'm specially gifted. I make glass out of the ash. He gives us the sit sack and he can make a bunch of things. So let's see. Yeah, he'll make flutes and stuff like that. Just a lot of hand, overall handy items. Yeah, here's Spinda. In this area you can find Spinda, Sandshrew, Skarmory, and Slugma. And another hidden item right here. TM32 Double Team. Now I don't know if I'll use that because I'm not a fan of the spam. But here we are in our next town. Fall Arbor. And this is where this episode is actually going to leave off. Right here in front of the Pokemon Center. In between episodes I'm going to go back and I'll take care of all the trainers that I missed on purpose. And we will make our way towards you know the next spot. So thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys next time on Pokemon Emerald. Take care and be safe.